Tables of contents are an important feature of almost any book, whether in print or electronic format. And if you're making an ebook with InDesign, you can have a navigational TOC created for you when you export your document to EPUB. All you need to do is first create a table of contents style and then tell InDesign to use that style in the export dialog box. Let's check it out. Here I have a small chunk of a larger document that comprises a book called The Complete Book of Cheese. And even though this is not the full book, we can definitely use it to demonstrate how a table of contents style can create a navigational TOC in an ebook. The first thing to note is that all my text is properly styled with paragraph styles. So if I click in the text frame and look in the paragraph styles panel, I can see that my chapter title is properly styled and I can scroll down, select this poetry title, it's styled, and so are my chapter subheads. This is essential for creating a table of contents style, which I can now do by going to the layout menu and choosing table of contents styles down here at the bottom. I'll click new. I'll call this book of cheese. And now I can choose which paragraph styles are applied to the content that I want in my TOC. In this case, it's going to be the chapter title, chapter subhead, and poetry title and I can add those just by double clicking on them. And I'll make sure that the levels are set properly. So my chapter titles are set to level one, chapter subheads are level two, and so are the poetry titles. So I'll just make that level two. I also have options down here in the bottom of the dialog box to format the text in an on-page TOC. But note that these don't apply to a navigational TOC. If I were making an on-page TOC, I'd also make sure to select this option here, Make Text Anchor in Source Paragraph. That way, all the text links in the on-page TOC would go to the right chapter headings and so on. But again, I'm not going to worry about that right now, since all I'm concerned with is making a navigational TOC. So I'll click OK, and OK again to save my table of contents style. And let's export to EPUB. Press Command or Control E. I'll export to the desktop. The format will be Reflowable EPUB, and click Save. In the General Options, where it says Navigation TOC, I'll make sure I choose Multi-Level TOC Style, and I'll choose the TOC style that we just created, Book of Cheese. I'll click OK. And the EPUB opens here in iBooks. Now, certainly, this isn't the most beautiful eBook ever created. Sure, there's lots more that I could do to clean it up. But one thing it does have is a navigational TOC, which I can see by mousing over the title bar on the left side and clicking. And so I have my chapter titles, I have that poetry title, and I have all my chapter subheads. And I can click on them to navigate through the ebook. And if I do something like change the size of the text so these titles jump to different pages, that's no problem. Go back to the navigational TOC and I can see the page numbers are updated and the links all still work. So in this movie, we saw how to make a navigational TOC, a very useful feature for any ebook. And you can get one just by creating a TOC style in InDesign, add the paragraph styles for the content you want in the TOC, and then just tell InDesign to use that TOC style for the navigational TOC when you export the EPUB.